Jim out of there. I tell you one thing. It's come down to a situation where it looks like that. I was going to tell Tojo I'm going to have a ball bat sitting underneath that desk. You can put up a lot of things in there, and I don't have any question in my mind that Tojo Yamamoto could kill me. But I'll tell you one doggone thing. We're not going to take it lightly, and I just want you to know that, Tojo. Come out here right now because I got a message from you. I just got off the phone with Jerry Jarrett explaining exactly what happened on it down there. Now don't come out here swinging that. All right, you may get in a lick it. Yeah. No, I don't want to fight you, but I'll tell you what you're not going to do. You're not going to push me around in that. I may only get one lick, but I'll hit you right in the face with this. It's not worth to fight an old man, old crow like you. Yeah, all right. Well, just remember that, because I'll tell you, if I don't get but one lick, it'll be a good one right in the back. I don't want to fight you, Tojo. You're, I'll tell you what you are, though. I said it before, you're trash. You're absolutely a disgrace to your people. You do sneaky things. I talked to Jerry Jarrett. You're screaming, get me Jerry Jarrett. I told him what you did to Eddie Marlin, what you did to his son Jeff Jarrett out there. He said three words, sign the match. He's not afraid of you. Oh, One no, eye no, or any of that. Yeah. And I'm going to beat that dirty dog. Bunda! All right. Yeah, you beat him. This is one time. I don't pull for too many, Ralph. I do pull for some, but I don't just openly root for somebody to get hurt. But I'll tell you one thing, Dave. This is a situation where I'm going to be sitting, waiting, watching for Jerry Jarrett. There's a time when you've got to do things, and Jerry Jarrett feels the same way. He's got one eye that's bad. He's got the other eye that partially been histoplasmosis. But he is a man, and he's not going to put up with that kind of stuff happening out there. And he will meet Yamamoto in the ring. He'd rather meet him in the parking lot if he was right out here. But the match, he said, and I applaud him for it, sign the match. There's a time you got to do things. The match is signed. We'll take time out, be back in a moment. We got more of it. Well, the folks will be interested in this uh, was uh, kind of as a result of, of the situation that occurred. Uh, it took place in the Mid-South Coliseum in Memphis, Tennessee. We've got some highlights from a Jerry Jarrett, Tojo Yamamoto match. I want you to look at this. All right, nice hip toss. Remember, these two guys were once partners, and in addition to that, were longtime respected Southern Tag Team champions. Jerry Jarrett starts right out working on the arm. Boy, it sounded to me like his arm popped. That's exactly what Jerry said he was going to do. He's going to break his arm. Well, you know, I got no love for Tojo, but I'll tell you, when he put that Japanese bar on it, he's doing it again, Eddie. You know, there's a point of where it goes beyond wrestling in there. Tojo should have thought about that in the weeks behind us, Lance. I have no sympathy for him whatsoever. There was a distinct pop when Jerry put that Japanese armbar. He's beating on his arm now. Yum Yamamoto. Leave him alone, Frank. Screaming as Jerry still pounding on the arm. Pushes referee Frank Morrell back. And he is still going after it as he pulls Jarrett off. Uh-oh. Here comes Sato Goto, Jeff Jarrett, Pat Tanaka. Minute and 32 seconds. I believe, I'm certain that Jerry has, he broke his arm, Randy. the ninja being manhandled by the referee with Sato and Tanaka down there Jeff Jarrett and Goto and Tanaka Sato and Jeff Jarrett here comes the king Yeah. 
Uh, just uh, a comment or two. Uh, that was Eddie Marlin I was talking to that came there to see it. And I want to I want to say this right now. Uh, this is a part of the championship wrestling program we're not particularly fond of, but it is imperative. I feel that we get both sides in any kind of a situation. Uh, that is why even after what he did last week, we're going to permit Tojo Yamamoto an opportunity to have his say. Now, I do want to say this. I have made it clear to Tojo that I am full and I this is this is no kidding with Tojo Yamamoto and he knows I mean what I said. Uh, I will sue you if you lay your hands on me and start beating on me Tojo. Now what I'm going to do is tell you that you've got a minute and a half to say what you want to say and I'll stand here and hold the microphone. You give me a microphone. Only what will you give me? Jerry Tennant. You tried to break my arm last night. You put your best hold last night. But you never broke my arm. I was too strong. I went to the doctor. Doctor said my arm only fractured. He want to put in cash. I don't like it because I am too strong. Jerry Jarrett, this is not the end now. This is just the starting of the war. I tell you, you're going to pay everything for this. Oh, go to the hotel. で、お前、お前のことでか。見てよ、てめえこれ、逆に撃ってるんだな、これ野郎。見てよ、これ野郎。俺たちじゃねえこれ、肩痛いって言ってみや、これ野郎。俺は撃ってんだ、これ野郎